Hi, my name's uh, Declan Moody. I'm a bonsai jiu-jitsu black belt out of Adelaide, Australia, M16, where I teach and train with uh, Craig Jones' brother, Adam. I decided to come to B-Team to train because it's where most of the best guys in the world are. Not only that, I've known Craig for a very long time and I'm very close with his brother. Declan's a black belt. He's a high-level competitor around Australia. He's done pretty well ADCC trials and he's won tons of super fights within Australia now. I came out here for three months and uh, the goal was to get as much training and competition in as I could uh, and it was perfect timing. I got to be here for the ADCC camp and uh, Nikki's EBI camp. Yeah, Declan's a cool guy. He, uh, he was pretty quiet when he first came in but that's like, uh, that's, probably, that's probably a good way to be. You don't want to come in and be <laughs> Uh, too aggressive or anything straight away because you're probably going to have a rough time. But Declan would just show up every day, accept roles against everyone. Even if it was to his detriment, he'd roll with Nicky Rod every day, so he's braver than most of the people here. Uh, the, the experience out here has been crazy, you know. The level of training out here has been unreal. Um, I, f I feel my levels already jumped so, so far in just such a short time. Uh, just the exposure to the high level guys getting thrown around by Nicky and Craig repeatedly and having uh, Ethan and Nicky Ryan and all the guys be able to answer questions and beat me up, it's been fantastic. No matter how bad any of the rounds went, he'd always accept another round, he'd always keep trying. So he had really the perfect attitude to learn here. I, I'd say my game has changed quite a lot. My wrestling has improved incredibly. Um, just concepts that I didn't understand fully before. When Declan first got here, uh, I would say probably his weaknesses, and he probably knew that they were his weaknesses, would uh, be sort of uh, the wrestling, uh, some of those scrambling positions. I would say when he first came in, he would concede to the bottom, and some, sometimes when he didn't have to, just sort of through, for self-preservation and fatigue. And then by the end of it, uh, much, much harder to pin, much harder to hold down and as a result of that, much harder to submit. I have such a deeper understanding of the sport now and the things that I should be doing that I wasn't before and just different looks that I've been able to add to my game. I think it's a combination of being in the environment and you can see uh, information anywhere but you can't feel it, you know. I think until you feel how something's being applied, you don't fully understand it, no matter how much information there is on the topic. Yeah, I would say a guy like Declan's the perfect visitor, right, because he's a really cool guy, really relaxed, he likes to scrap and train super hard and no matter how bad you beat him up, he's going to keep coming, he's going to keep trying, right? And that's the sort of energy that you need to get better. Those are the sort of people uh, we really want to hear, you know? I think everyone here has been so welcoming and so helpful with me. I'm so grateful to all the guys here and like um, just how they accepted me in, beat me up, showed me everything that they were so open with their techniques and any question they had was answered straight away. No hesitation. So, yeah, hopefully more Aussies come out. If you're back in Australia, definitely book Declan for a seminar. He's, uh, he's improved so much. He's really took the time to study all the stuff we do out here at V-Team. Having Craig here, it's become like the embassy of Australia at V-Team. So uh, it's a good connection for all the Australian guys out here. And the level hasn't necessarily been uh, world class for long in Australia, but you're seeing guys come out now that are smashing it. Ah, dude, so sad. Such a great training partner and a cool dude. And the mullet, come on, yeah, yeah, yeah. iconic. We, we have a wave of Aussies coming through all the time. And what's funny is because the mullet's so big in Australia right now, each and every one of them has mullets. So yeah, hopefully more Aussies come out. And if you're back in Australia, definitely book Declan for a seminar. He's, uh, he's improved so much and he's really took the time to study all the stuff we do out here at BJ. For anyone out there in Australia that wants to come and train with the best in the world, this is the place for sure. You'll be welcome with open arms and you'll learn so much.